Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. This is a tribute to honor and show respect for Miss Allen, age 50, murdered August 23rd, 2022 in Bogalusa, Louisiana. Never heard of it. It's about 80 miles north slightly northeast of New Orleans. Miss Allen was a mother and a grandmother. And she was beautiful inside and out. This is a D shame for this type of stuff to happen in a small town. But that's what you have in the black community. You have this ridiculous type crimes that people who are doing these crimes need to be punished severely. Life in prison without parole or the death penalty. This is what they deserve. Bogalusa mayor call, calls for calm after woman killed in drive-by shooting Tuesday. D-Shane. D-Shane. God bless Miss Allen. God bless her soul. And definitely God bless her family and friends. Photos, news feed follows. Damn. Old woman and innocent bystander was killed in a drive-by shooting. Mike McDaniel joining us now live from Bogalusa. This could have been. Uh, this is already a horrific situation, and we're hearing about more violence that's happening in that area. Yeah, Sharice, and this was a woman who was simply sitting in a chair inside her own living room getting her hair done when bullets came through the window. That's when family members say 50-year-old Veronique Allen was shot in the head. This all happened just after the noon hour on Main Street. Police say someone drove up and just opened fire with no regard for who may have been inside the house. Police do not believe Allen was the intended target here. There are multiple gunshots through the windows and family members say there were several people inside the house at the time which put all of their lives at risk. Family members and authorities say this type of violence has gotten out of hand here in Bogalusa. Just last month there was another shooting that left our young rapper dead and his father injured. The mayor says this type of violence is happening too often and it's past time this community unite and not be afraid to speak up. Family members of Allen are upset and pleading for someone to come forward with information which authorities say is another challenge here in Bogalusa. For this to happen to her at her home, it is just, it's, it hurts. It hurts so bad because she did deserve it. She was a beautiful person inside and, and out. out. I had to see my cousin being carried out of her mom's house in a body bag for what 
for no reason because she did not do it because powers monsters had the audacity in broad daylight to drive down a street and shoot into someone's house Alan has four children of her own and several grandchildren. I did check in with police just before we came on the air. So far, no arrests have been made, but police do expect one. Reporting live from Bogalusa, Mike McDaniel, Eyewitness News.